Hey guys, you're joining us here on Music on the Menu, the TV version, and I'm back here at 105 The River, and I'm located at the Mohegan Sun Pocono with Alan Stout. He is the host of the radio version of Music on the Menu, and Alan, you know, we wanted to do a little banter of get to know Janine and Alan a little bit yeah. before we introduce our, our guest tonight. That's so, fine. Uh, this is your uh, 25th year of doing music on the menu? Yeah, 25 years of doing music in Northeast PA, and the radio show came a little later. The music on the menu came in 94, but okay. start writing full-time in 93, late 92. Yeah. yeah, we have some similarities, though, because we, our kids I see on Facebook, and our kids both, you know, full-time job with Little League. As yeah. Little League <laughs> parents out there know, it's a full-time, a second full-time job. It's a lot of running around, a lot of practices, a lot of games. We were both talking about how our, our sons were playing the other night till 10 o'clock at oh night. Oh my God, I probably have like red eyes today because <laughs> if you're playing till 10, they don't get to bed till 11 or 11.30. Nine and years old. Getting up playing, six, yeah. you know. They're dedicated, they love it. You know, they're not complaining. The parents are yawning oh, maybe. I know, I know. But it, it's it's amazing. I wouldn't I wouldn't change it. I love, I love watching him play Yeah, me too. Baseball. Me too. My son is really He's really, you know, diving in now. He really yeah. wants to work and get better. And yeah. I must have pitched him 500 balls in the backyard the one weekend. Just, That's you know, he just hits and hits and hits. Now he's nine. See, my son, this yeah. is his last year. So oh. he pitches and he's... Okay. You know, this is our big year now, the, the last of all the, the yeah, firsts. Yeah, the 12 years, coming up. That's, mm -hmm. that's, that's, and they're usually pretty good ball players mm -hmm. by that point, too. You, to, that's a, you could watch a really good baseball game yeah. with 12 year olds. Yeah. yeah. So we have baseball in common, and my son's birthday is May, and your son's birthday is in April. April, right? yeah, yeah. So, yeah, the boys, and then you have a daughter. I have a I daughter do, as well. I do, my daughter. She's running, uh, she's running cross country. How about it? So, yeah, it's a lot of, a lot of, a lot of running around. Yeah. Well, my kid plays, um, field hockey, but Alyssa's getting ready to start high school. Oh, man. So we're, we're entering ninth grade. Buckle up. Buckle up. <laughs> <laughs> but I mean, uh, everyone likes music. Maybe yep. not, uh, you know, the kids would probably listen to some of the 80s music. I know we just had a, a dance at their school and they did like an, an 80s theme, which was nice. The, the, the high school kids like 80s music? But seventh and eighth grade, they did like an 80s That's theme. That's interesting. And they were hemming and hawing about it, but then they, they all had a good time. That's interesting. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, well, I mean, well, think about it. When I was in high school, I was listening to Elvis Presley and the Beatles, and, yeah. and that music was 25, uh, 30 years old, some of it. So, yeah, I mean, I think people just assume that a generation of people are always going to, you know, kind of be fixated on music from their time, but mm -hmm. that's not been the case at all. I interview a lot of bands who are guys in their 20s and they love Led Zeppelin, you know, so. I think you always <laughs> think your music is the best music, but we know that our music is the best music, <laughs> right? But uh, we want to introduce our guest. You Dave know, because Brown. Dave, Dave is here, Dave Brown, and he is with Dishonest Fiddlers, right? You actually created Dishonest Fiddlers. Yeah. It's and you're a local Brown boy, right? Sorry? You're a local guy. I'm local, yeah. I live uh, up in Scranton, and uh, I'm from Wayne County, Pennsylvania. Nice. And, uh, you know. Been a musician all your life? Um, well, no. Okay. <laughs> uh, I mean, I, I played a piano when I was little, and I grew up in a musical family, and you know, my grandma sang in the church choir, and, uh, you know. Your my, my dad took me out to see uh, great music from a real young age, so. Okay. Um, but you talk about people discovering music maybe not from their generation. I mean, you know, Dave, he's, he's a bluegrass mm -hmm. man. Dave, how old are you? 31. 31 years old. And so I never ask a girl how old she is. So this is <laughs> yeah, okay. But a guy, right I can this do is it. okay. But you grew up in the 2000s, basically. Late right. 90, that's well, when you were grew up, I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you were raised. Yeah. Anyway. But I mean, you know, but your in musical influences, obviously a lot of them predate that. I mean, you're not playing, you know, uh, Three Doors Down. No, know, or, or uh, Godsmack, or you know, Nickelback. You right. Know, I mean, we're playing like <laughs> you know Woody Guthrie songs. Exactly. And, you know. How do, would you ex describe your music? Um, I would say it's uh, it's kind of old timey mm -hmm. sounding, but it's, it's fun. It's I well, I hope so. <laughs> fun, uplifting. I, and we're going to hear a lot about it tonight because the format of our show has changed. Music on the menu, the the TV version, and uh, now we're having the the musician on that is actually performing yeah, in Breakers, so it's, it's really going to be awesome um, to, to see you perform right. as much. So what would you like our audience to know about you, the person, David? Um, well, I think I'm, uh, I've got a band called the, the Dishonest Fiddlers, but to be, on, to be honest, uh, the music is pretty straightforward. It's mm -hmm. stories about myself, it's stories about my upbringing, it's stories about my community and you know the people I encounter and just uh, everyday stuff that I think almost anybody could get into if you gave it a chance and listened to it. 
Um, I've got a killer band that I couldn't be happier to be playing with right now. And Give them a shout out. The, the way that the it's all kind of fell together. Um, well, we're, we're playing at the NEPA Bluegrass Festival this year mm -hmm. um, up in Tunkhannock. And uh, last year I was there, I camped out next to who is now my guitar player. That's awesome. Is that how we, you met him? Talk about yeah. networking. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I picked the right spot. Yeah, you did. And we, we camped. And we, we camped. We stayed up all night a couple nights in a row around the campfire. I played every song I knew. and. You know he he hasn't you know stopped enjoying the, the music yet. And lucky for me, he's a he's a killer guy and great musician. Um, Jamie Novak is playing drums with us. He uh, you know very well known musician. Very well known in the area. He played you know, some great bands. Played with Cabinet. Played with uh, played with George Wesley also. Um, and uh, it, it's it's a that's that's a new instrument for our band. We didn't have a drummer. We also didn't have a fiddler, mm -hmm. which I'll uh, mark Woody That's at. That's kind of funny. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You're a dishonest fiddler. We're, minus we're, the fiddler. We're, uh, we're, we're clever, <laughs> I guess. <laughs> uh, but you have a fiddler now? I have a fiddler okay. now. And we always had the double bass fiddle. The upright okay. bass is uh, technically the double bass fiddle. He's okay. twice as dishonest as the rest of us. How about it? Uh, and that's a new guy also too recently. Um, his name's Bob Wilson. Our fiddler though, before I get ahead of myself, is named Mark Woodyat, who um, it's, it's, uh, he's kind of a freakishly good, cool guy and uh, uh, excellent musician. Um, it, it's a really cool group. I'm, I'm, I'm lucky to be to be part of it. Sounds know. like you have a lot of fun. Is this your full-time gig? Is yeah, this what you do? I, no, I, well, I mean, this is definitely a full-time gig, but mm -hmm. I also work for St. Joseph Center in Dunmore, oh okay. uh, Pennsylvania. I was there this morning, actually, for a couple hours. Hey, this, is, this is a good person here. I mean, Dave, you know, I did an article about you for the newspaper about a year or two ago. I and, think so, yeah. Yeah, and you know, what you do, you know, to help people yeah. outside of music is, is wonderful. You got, you got a good heart. Well, I, I, you know, it, it kind of works both ways, and I get to play music for the kids you know, when, when I have an opportunity, which it, if I had a chance to, if anybody wants to give me a college scholarship to go get a music therapy degree, <laughs> I would love to do that. How you know? about that? If this music band thing doesn't work out, I'll play music for those kids all day. You'd know? be great at that. You'd be great at that. But we're, uh, we're doing, we do benefits for them every, you know, maybe like once a year or something. Okay. Um, another benefit that we're doing is for the Lackawanna River, um, uh, the the River Fest uh, coalition. Co okay. yeah, that? They, they basically watch the ecology of the river. And they do sure a, they do a few events a year. Yeah. We're doing one May twelfth with those guys. So okay. yeah, they're good people. And you have a Facebook page? We do. Look up uh, the Dishonest Fiddlers. All right. When we come back, we're going to hear the Dishonest Fiddlers because they are performing live in Breakers. Stay with us. Hey guys, we're here having a great time at the river located at the Mohegan Sun Pocono. I'm with Alan Stout. He is the host of the Music on the Menu radio version. And I hope you're getting used to TV because I'm kind of digging the radio. Yeah, I mean, we took the winter off, but we're we back did. now. We did a couple of shows in the fall. So what do you do, about six now, I guess? Yeah, yeah. We're, we're on a roll now. We I mean, all these cameras momentum. and lights and everything. <laughs> we're not, DC and I are not used to that. We could probably do this show in the dark, uh, right. but um, it is cool, you know, and you know, it's putting the experience on you know what's exciting for me is is you know getting people like Dave and getting mm -hmm. them on television as well yeah it's good exposure but I remember <laughs> the first time we did our first show and Alan was kind of like you know sitting back in his chair because you know they the, you know, I, I and, I'm like, and I'm sitting all yeah, proper and, yeah, my, yeah. and I'm, I'm like Alan this is TV oh, you yeah, gotta remember oh, yeah, yeah, we're doing the yeah. TV thing like they can see you out there yeah. it's like, oh, okay I'm not used to that I so. gotta comb my hair now and now everything. you have to comb your hair and look nice <laughs> You know, make sure you take a shower and all. <laughs> but we're all good. We're all clear now. But anyway, we're, we're with David Brown, and he uh, is with Dishonest Fiddlers, and they're performing. We're going to hear their music, Inside Breakers. And if uh, you, you don't get a chance, I mean, the weather has, it has you know, snow's gone. So come up to Breakers. No it's snow. once a month every, uh, is it the first Tuesday? First Tuesday of the month. We got uh, Dustin Douglas in June and Aaron Fink in July. And I, don't, I haven't figured out August yet, but I'll probably know that's, Pretty soon. Our by local by artists. next month, I'll know. Yes. But David, you have uh, new music out, which yes. was premiered on the radio show. He got like a like an early copy. Yes, yeah. he's special. Yeah. All right, so tell us about some of the new music that's um, coming out. Well, the music I've been, you know, we've actually got another record, which is close close behind this one. Um, we've been working on two projects, and we've, you know, we're going to have two records this year. Um, 
The next one's called Based on a True Story, which kind of ties in with the, the band name. And um, this, this record that we're about to release has kind of more of a more of a serious tone, I would think, with some of the some of the music, and that's part of the the name for the. Uh, the record, which is Deeper Shade of Blue, okay. um, it contains songs that are kind of referencing uh, the, the Steamtown. We have the Steamtown Blues on there, and we have, you know, some newer songs, which I think you're gonna take a listen, and I think you'll you'll really enjoy them. Um, it's so, all are you dishonest, Dave, or yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Just checking it out? <laughs> He's yeah, like, yeah, a, yeah. That's one of the coolest names for a record I've heard in a long Thanks. time. Based on a true story, I love I'm that. <laughs> that is a Dishonored great Dave. name for an album. Thank you. I love that. <laughs> Thank you. Well, well I, wish, I wish I thought of that. <laughs> well, there you go. <laughs> if I ever put out an album, that would have been a, that's a great name. There you I, go. All right. That's the, that's the second record. That's t that's number two. Okay, a lot of new music coming from these guys. All yeah. right. And what are we hearing tonight? Tonight you're hearing music from. Uh, you're going to hear a couple songs from from the second one too. Awesome. You'll hear a blend. You know. Awesome. All right. You'll well, hear a couple old ones, a couple of the yet to come, and the, you know. Listen, listen in. Okay. <laughs> again, you can check them out on Facebook and. Uh, Come out the, this summer. You'll be at some of those festivals as well. We'll be at uh, we'll be at the River Street Jazz Cafe May 18th. We'll be at that uh, the River Fest mm -hmm. May 12th. I'm going backwards here. Okay. Um, I'm at the North Slope Brewing Company every first Sunday of the month. Um, so that's all year long down in Dallas. Great little brew pub, all ages, and it's free. Um, yeah, these are cool rooms you're playing. They're nice venues. They're oh, fun. Cool. Listen to original music, support local, which I love about Bold Gold and SSP TV. You know, we're supporting local. Dave, thanks for My uh, pleasure. coming Thank on you. Uh, the TV version. Yep. Um, I'm still learning the ropes on the music end, but. That's why Alan's fine. here, right? <laughs> I have some purpose in life, anyway. <laughs> All right. All right. Besides well, going to baseball games. There you go. Well, you know, that keeps us busy. And then follow us on SSP TV News because Alan is an interesting character. He's been doing radio for 25 years, and we're learning about some of the interesting musicians that he's met um, and worked with some really famous artists. So we'll talk about that on some other programming. I agree with you. I'm a character. I don't know You're if I'm character. an interesting character. You're an interesting character. Here we are. Is answering interested. machine? <laughs> no, I haven't. That's probably a whole nother show, I'm sure. Oh, I got it. The answering machine thing is funny because I, I, a lot of people are calling me for the first time that I meet from my kids' little league or events at school, and they'll call like three. Is that real? Is that well, real? Well, first of all, you still have an answering machine. No, I'm I mean on my on phone. That. No, okay. on my phone. Okay. My voicemail. Okay. Yeah. Let's, let's go yes, there. Yes, it's okay. real. Good, yes, good, it's good. real. And I, I've, I've had probably 10 people in the last month say, is that really him? Well, I'll have to put his cell phone number on the screen, and you can all check it out. People, this is Paul Stanley of Kiss, and Alan's not around. We're out rocking and rolling, but when he gets back in, he's going to call you. So leave your name, number, and a brief message. See ya. <laughs> We're running out of time. We want to listen to your music, so check out uh, Music on the Menu, the radio show. Um, it's on 8 p.m. Sundays. 9 o'clock Sundays. 9 o'clock Sunday. Sunday nights on the river, 9 to 10. Very good. And here we go. Let's check out some music by the Dishonest Fiddlers. Please give a warm welcome for the Dishonest Fiddlers from Scranton. <laughs>
things never change. Some say it's all the same. Some say it's best to listen just in case. There's a sunset I'm after, and I don't know how many more chapters it'll take till this traveler finds that old home place. And I'll be rolling down that old road. And I'll be rolling down my window where the breeze rolling through from the place I once knew. Buddy, I'm telling you that I'm tearing at my tiles for some highway miles. I'm a chopping at the bit just to get right out of here and get rolling down that old road. And I'll roll on down my window with the breeze rolling through from the place I once knew. Buddy, I'm sing along and make those folks at home really feel this audience here. We got a great crowd here at the Breakers Bar. Hi, Sheldon.
Rowing my boat and I'm going merrily down the ditch, everybody. Well, there ain't enough water in the water. There ain't enough air in the air. There ain't enough money in my pockets. I need better 